Hello everybody, I hope you're having a great afternoon. Um, here it's Monday and um, my computer's broke. So it's at the computer doctor right now, hopefully getting fixed and they said they probably could have it done tomorrow. That's if all goes well. So we'll see how that goes. Hopefully you'll be watching this on Tuesday. I'm just gonna keep filming like I normally would, leave it on my SD. And if I go buy a new laptop tomorrow or get my old one back, I will be ready just to start uploading. So today I went to Ingalls. I, I really had some things I needed to pick up for us, some things I wanted to see if they had, and some organizational things that I wanted. Um, and this is really like another pre-Thanksgiving shopping haul. Now I have the main pre-Thanksgiving shopping haul coming up like in a day when I go get every last food item I need for Thanksgiving. But this is really not that. But this does include some things for Thanksgiving. So it is kind of like pre-Thanksgiving food haul part two. So everything I got here I got at Ingalls. That's my local grocery store. I used some coupons for a few things. And um, I got some things that um, you know I thought we could use. Some things I needed. Some things I wanted. So let me start over here. So, I got a huge roaster, but I really don't like it that much. So, I decided to see if I could find a roaster at my grocery store. This one is by Good Cook. It's the premium non-stick 15 by 11. It's the large roast pan, which is really nice. It's deep. And it came with this rack. I actually measured it as soon as I came in and seen if I could fit my 23-pound turkey in here, and I can. So I'm very excited to have a new roaster. I'm sure I will have it for many, many, many years to come. Um, and then I wanted some of these temporary dishes, um, these spoil pans, so I could, um, you know, not use every pan in the house. I'm going to make a pumpkin icebox cake in one of these. I think I'll put some macaroni and cheese in one. I know they're not perfect or glamorous, but feeding our family, they'll be fine. And um, while I was in the cooking area, or the, you know, the Thanksgiving area, um, I saw this football platter, and I don't know, it was just a dollar. I thought it was really cute for maybe some wings that were serving, um, you know, while the game is going on for the lunch while I'm cooking. I just thought it was cute, and it would just be a part of our household for probably more many years to come, just because I save everything, and hopefully it holds up. It's not cracked or anything. I checked real well. And I'm sure I'll put some wings on it or whatever snacks that I'm serving during Thanksgiving um, Day or any other, you know, like football game time. So we'll come just this way. Um, I have these stack and nest bins um, under my kitchen sink. They're by Starplast and they work so well. And I have another area that I want to um, organize. So I just got another. They're another uh, set. There's three bins and they just stack. These are really convenient under my kitchen sink and for that same area which I'll show you later that I'm organizing I got some more of these long um, drawer sorters and I actually have some of these under my kitchen sink too. Speaking of my kitchen sink we love these mats that you can put in the bottom um, because it prevents your dishes from like hitting real hard and chipping or breaking. Ours looked really beat up. I just wanted a new one before everybody came. Just for one side of the sink. That's all we use that on. I actually threw my old one away not too long ago. So we've been kind of going without it. Um, and then over here to household stuff. I just got some more um, dish cloths. These are just thin. We go through these quite a bit. I don't only wash dishes with them. Sometimes I'll dust with them or whatever. But I got another stack. For that area I am organizing. I got two more things I have you know what's so funny is I have both of these under my kitchen sink too sometimes I take this off but these are for the area that I'm organizing these are just some self-adhesive hooks and this over the door hanger and I just wanted to make sure those self-adhesive hooks were sticky enough and I got some more of these little sticky things and then we'll just kind of move on around to the cleaning stuff I'm doing a lot of hauls here lately let me just kind of sit down to make it easier. So, I needed some more makeup removers. I got these new Neutrogena ones. I had a coupon, and I got these for $4. So, happy about that. Um, at Ingalls, I usually buy the Mrs. Myers Clean Day um, Countertop Spray. This is in lavender. I haven't done a full review on it. I probably will. 
but this is the Mrs. Myers Geranium Scent Liquid Dish Soap, which I love. So I got two more of these um, just to have downstairs in the kitchen. This is actually the countertop spray, and um, I like it a lot, and it smells really nice. I also got some more Comet that we like to use sometimes in the toilets or in the bathtub. Um, I got some more tub um, stuff to clean the tub. Scott used my little brush um, actually on the carpet. So I needed another one from under the sink. There that is. I also got this um, shower clean stuff. You need to spray it in like the bubble stuff. I got some more cleaner. I actually picked this up at the dollar store. Um, and this actually. Those two things came from the dollar store. I was actually in there to see if I could find any cheaper storage bins than these, and I couldn't. So I just got those. Also, at Ingles, I got some Brillo Basics just to clean um, some hard stains um, off of my cast iron skillets. So I got a package of those. I was out of downy, so I got some more of that. I think I'm going to go back to my dryer balls, though. I lost mine, and I think I'm going to buy some more. Um, I wasn't sure how many paper towels we had, so I just grabbed one row. I thought these little pumpkin plates were perfect. They were discounted. They were 50 cents a piece. Um, for dessert, I think there's eight in them. So, I got three stacks of those, 24 little cups. I wanted some more pie crust because I'm not making my own pie crust this year. I'm just not doing it. Um, I don't see it being necessary. And um, I had a coupon for those. They were two for five um, on sale and then I had a dollar off coupon so I got two for four love that and then I got some more paper plates of course because we use those to feed the kitty cats and those came from the dollar store too I got some hefty stronger seals ziplocs these are just the sandwich size and we use those in Jackson's lunch all the time on over to the food I am hungry so I bought one of these um, Stouffer Sal Salisbury Steaks. It's in the microwave right now waiting on me and I'm starving so I'm going to eat that in just a few minutes. And then I got some snack food. Um, Scott really was complaining that he was out of ice cream. This one was on sale for $4. I had a coupon for 50 cents off so I got the Edie's Slow Cured Mint Chocolate Chip Ice Cream for $3.50 which isn't bad. I got two things of Pringles. Jackson wanted some barbecue Pringles so I got him those. I got me regular. And then I saw these and just like fell in love not only with the packaging which I know is stupid but I did with these Angie's um, white chocolate peppermint kettle corn. Look at that. Oh my goodness. And I got the Angie's dark chocolate tear sea salt kettle corn. Okay, so I'm totally going to do reviews on those, and um, I'll let you guys know how good they taste. Um, I'm excited to try them. I also had a coupon for some Chex Mix. It sounded good because I was hungry, and I shouldn't have bought it, but I had a coupon. It was like $3.98 for this value size at my store. had a coupon for, I think, like a dollar off, so I got these for like two-something. I got a, um, a case of Cokes. And then we needed kitty litter, so I got two of the Tidy Cat Multiple Cat litters, which I'm going to switch out as soon as I'm done eating. So that was my haul today. Let me kind of put it back and not stack it up on everything. Um, and it will only be like a day at the most, maybe two, before I am back um, at the store. So I'm going to get this stuff put away. I'm not going to work on my organization pro project till maybe tonight, if I have time. Um, I think I'm going to do some baking tonight, or at least get that pumpkin um, refrigerator um, dessert, icebox cake, excuse me, um, done tonight. I will probably do that, and I will probably film that. And um, I hope you've enjoyed this haul. I will have a few more before Thanksgiving, which I know today is Monday, so I'll be uploading them quickly. Um, and, um, yeah, Thanksgiving is here. Can you believe it? It's only in three days. I cannot believe how fast time has went by this year. I hope you've enjoyed watching and if you like this video and want to see more, be sure to subscribe and we will talk to you later. Say goodbye. Tell them bye, Rocco. Bye-bye.